Welcome to this presentation on the additive effect of transformational leadership. In this presentation, you will learn about transactional leadership and its two factors, and about transformational leadership and its four factors. You will also learn how transformational leadership moves followers to performance beyond expectations. Keeping the two similar sounding leadership styles straight can be challenging, but this presentation is designed to explain the differences. But first, please pause this presentation to consider a couple of advanced questions designed to set the stage for your learning by prompting you to recall what you already know. With this in mind, spend a few moments thinking about leadership experiences you have had, either as a leader or as a subordinate. What leadership factors impressed you most favorably? What leadership factors impressed you least favorably? And how did your leadership style or the style of your boss affect your work outcomes? We'll start with transactional leadership, which does not individualize the needs of subordinates or focus on their personal development. Transactional leaders exchange things of value with subordinates to advance their own and their subordinates' agendas. Transactional leadership, as depicted in this slide, is comprised of two factors, contingent reward and management by exception. Two factors in transactional leadership are contingent reward, that is, that effort by followers is exchanged for specific rewards, and number two, management by exception. That is, leadership that involves corrective criticism, negative feedback, and negative reinforcement. The result of transactional leadership is specified, expected outcomes. Transactional leaders are influential because it is in the best interest of subordinates for them to do what the leader wants. But what might boost expected outcomes to performance beyond expected outcomes? 1990 research by Bass and Avioli found an additive effect of transformational leadership. Transformational leadership, with its emphasis on intrinsic motivation and follower development, is the process whereby a person engages with others and creates a connection that raises the level of motivation and morality in both the leader and the followers. It tries to link the identity of followers to the collective identity of the organization. There are four factors to transformational leadership. Factor number one is idealized influence or the charisma of the leader. Factor number two is inspirational motivation, or the use of symbols and emotional appeals to focus group members' efforts to achieve more than they would in their own self-interest. Factor three is intellectual stimulation, or encouraging subordinates to be creative, innovative, and to challenge their own beliefs. And the final factor, number four, is individualized consideration, or a supportive climate where leaders listen to and assist followers with individual growth and development. As illustrated in this final figure, transformational leadership produces greater effects than transactional leadership whereas transactional leadership results in expected outcomes, transformational leadership results in performance that goes well beyond what is expected. In a 1996 meta-analysis of 39 studies in transformational literature, researchers found that people who exhibited 
transformational leadership were seen as more effective leaders with better work outcomes than those who exhibited only transactional leadership. These findings were true for higher and lower level leaders and for leaders in both public and private settings. Transformational leadership moves followers to accomplish more than what is usually expected of them. They become motivated to transcend their own self-interests for the good of the group or of the organization. For addif additional information on the additive effect of transformational leadership, please see Chapter 9, Transformational Leadership, in Peter G. Nordhaus's book, Leadership, Theory and Practice, 5th Edition. Now it's time to apply what you've learned. This exercise will help you build on the concepts addressed in this presentation. Select a contemporary leader whom you feel exhibits at least three of the four factors of transformational leadership. In a paper or a posting to an asynchronous discussion board of approximately 500 words, explain how your chosen leader exhibits factors of transformational leadership. This is the end of the presentation, The Additive Effect of Transformational Leadership. Thank you for viewing this video presentation.